Hi everyone! Welcome to Artsonia's After School Art Club. Today we have a fun art project from Trisha Fugelstad, an art teacher from Illinois. Hope you enjoy the video and don't forget to have your artwork uploaded to your Artsonia gallery. Hi, I'm Trisha Fugelstad, an art teacher at Dryden Elementary School in Arlington Heights. This creativity challenge is to make a four second stop motion animation. Stop motion animation is when you create the illusion of movement from a series of photos. So go find some objects that you want to move and get an iPad, set it up on an easel or pointing down from the edge of a table. And open up the iMotion app, which is free. When you get the app, click new movie, give it permission to use your camera, choose the manual mode, click start, set up your objects so that you can see them through the screen, click the display button, and then make sure that the single square is touched. That's going to give you a ghost image, which is really helpful for stop motion animation because it gives you a glimpse of what your previous picture looked like. You're going to make a four second movie. So think of your plan for movement. And you're going to take single photos, little by little, making changes until you've had 40 individual pictures. And then those 40 pictures will be set to 10 frames per second and will play back like a movie with your objects moving. If you make big changes from one to the other, the illusion won't work as well. So I move a little, click capture, move a little, click capture, always making sure my hands are not in the picture. But there is a way to fix it if you do. So here's my hand. I took a picture of it. But I'm going to just keep on going, take the pictures the way I wish they were, and instead of 40 pictures, I'm going to take 41 and go back and delete it. So when you're done, click stop, tap the screen, and it gives you a playback. I'm going to slide it until it says 10 frames per second. Use the tools button and forward through the photos until you find the one you want to delete. Touch the delete button and confirm. Now you're ready to export, save it to the photo library which will put it in your camera roll on your iPad, then you can upload it to Artsonia. If you're working collaboratively to make your stop motion animation, you could each take on a different role. The director would be the one who gets to make up what the animation will look like. The animators make it happen. The photographer double checks that there are no hands in the picture and takes each photo. Once you get the hang of this, you'll realize it can go pretty fast. So you can make a series of movies and switch roles each time so everybody gets a chance to be the director, animator, or photographer.